You have been selected for a covert assignment with Special Operations Command in conjunction with Galactic Terran Vasudan Intelligence. Our primary objective is to provide the Alliance with accurate and comprehensive information regarding the tactics, technologies, activities, and strategic objectives of forces hostile to the GTVA. At 0437, reconnaissance units received a coded transmission from Lieutenant Commander Snipes. The commander's vessel, the NTT Graal, is now adrift in a Shivan-infested region of the nebula and will not survive much longer. The Graal was docked to the NTC Alexandria when the cruiser ran our blockade of the Nosos portal in Gamma Draconis. Here is part of the actual transmission. We processed the message to enable better comprehension. Granite Mountain, this is Black Dove requesting immediate extraction. Engines and jump drives are inoperative. Location Delta 429er by 372. Deployed Pharaoh Speakins to assist search. Heavy Sheevan presence. Severe nebula storms. Probability of survival not good. As you know, Allied forces are in full retreat to Gamma Draconis, so logistical support will be virtually non-existent. We have no available reinforcements and only one recovery ship. We're operating in a Sheevan infested area, so expect a fierce enemy offensive. The odds are against you on this one, pilot. You know why you're here, pilot, so let's get down to work. Recon located a Pharos navigation buoy not far from where Snipes' transmission was received. Your wing will be inserted at that position to find the Grawl and make contact with Snipes. His transport has been incapacitated, and there's a high probability he's already a goner. This sector of the nebula is extremely volatile. Recon reports heavy EM interference, scrambling sensors and communications. These buoys are the only chance we have of finding Snipes and the Grawl. The EM storm will make aspect lock difficult to acquire and maintain, so we recommend you load out with Tempest and Rock Eyes. Once you locate Snipes, call in Lambda-1. This is critical. Do not deploy the recovery craft until you are ready. Our transport will dock with the Grawl and extract the survivors. You'll need to buy them some time as they complete this procedure. Good hunting. Hi everyone and welcome back to Free Space 2 and we are into the SOC loops again and look at what we get to fly, the Arinyes. Yep, massive gun firepower is what this thing has and we even get access to this, the UD-08 Kaiser. Uh, more powerful than the Prometheus cannon, but it does use a hell of a lot of uh, gun energy. Use a lot. <laughs> yeah, I'm not not going to beat it around the bush. Um, so I will need to play around with my power settings a little bit. Be my sensors are scrambled, sir. Experiencing heat of Yep, this that isn't a bug that's happening, that is what's supposed to happen. This is one of the most frustrating missions on the game. But here's a way to make it easy. Don't move anywhere at the start of the mission and then just go forwards. Don't follow the navigation beacons or anything like that, just go forwards. Order your wingmates to form up on your wing. When you encounter this group of enemies, tell them to engage the enemy so they don't get themselves killed and then just keep going and going and going and eventually you will hit the uh, you'll actually find the Graal now this is a fairly well known shortcut among the uh, free space community because this mission is just it, it's such a nightmare this mission if you are trying to follow the nav buoys and everything like that so I would recommend just do this and there are a couple of reasons for doing this loop. Number one, you get access to a brand new fighter at the end of it, and that fighter is amazing. And two, you get to do the mission after this one, which is probably the best mission in the game. So, you know, I'll leave it at that, but I am pretty I'm pretty sure it's the best mission in the game. If not the best, it's certainly the most memorable. 
And that's saying quite a lot, considering that this game has a lot of memorable missions. So you just have to put up with it with this one. So there's no hostiles on radar now, so I'm telling my guys to form up on my wing again. And I'm just going to hit my afterburners and get there. Try and keep your wingmates fairly close to you, sort of within two clicks. Um, otherwise, if they're too far away, you can get overwhelmed at the... Uh, other end, don't forget, because of the EMP, you can't use aspect seeking warheads either. Well, you can, but they won't work. Um, so, really, it's just uh, really the mission's designed to be as annoying and irritating as possible, and they do a pretty good job of it overall. Now, it's quite interesting that Snipes is still alive. I really would have thought that he'd have been executed by now by the NTF, but uh, obviously, he's. Uh, managed to wriggle his way out of that one. I'm glad because I like Snipes. You know, he's uh, he's definitely someone who has a very distinct personality within the Free Space Universe and uh, I would have liked to have seen a lot more of him if uh, they chose to develop the game after this. Yeah, that's Snipes, yet another intelligence officer who won't tell us anything unless we give him a favour. You know, kind of like the Iceni guy, but I suppose it's fair, you know, because at the end of the day, if we just if he just gave us the information, we could just leave and let him die. There's no need to risk ourselves out here. Uh, so, he's playing it smart from his end. And as you can see, the Kaiser weaponry just tore through a sheathing ship there. I'm sorry you didn't get to see all the conversation, but I was struggling like hell to call in Lambda 1 because the EMP just knackers your communication and everything. It's an absolute nightmare to deal with. But we've got Lambda 1 in and now it's a case of just trying to take down as many Sheevens as possible. Your wingmates will do a fairly decent job. Don't forget they are all in Irinius fighters and uh, they're going to be able to take care of themselves quite, uh, quite well. So really, it's up to uh, it's up to us to just stay alive and try and keep Lambda alive. Survivors are on board, sir. Release docking point now. Extraction complete. Return to base. All units return to base. Yep. Let's get the hell out of here, and I don't want to see this nebula ever again. Congratulations, pilot. You saved my life and I owe you big. If I had more clout with the brass, I'd have them give you a service medallion, but they don't just hand those out. You didn't have to volunteer for this assignment, but I'm damn glad you did. Now here's an important lesson. SOC didn't mount a rescue op because they liked me. They did it because I had information they needed, and information is what keeps you alive out here. Now I'm heading up the 99th for another mission, and I think we're going to need you on this one. I already cleared it with command, so it's your call, pilot. Hope you do the right thing. Intelligent, isn't he? Well, I will make the right call, and I'll see you next time.